pheasant. Like I say, I feel quite quite well actually. Um, sometimes I don't feel 70. I feel 30. And other times I feel ancient. At the moment, my lungs have had some real good working. They really have. My rib cage has been moving brilliantly. And I don't have to climb, see that hill there? I don't have to climb that today. I'm going down. When I get to the gate further up, I'm actually going down. There could be cow risks yet. But uh, I'll just see what happens. There might be ways around it. The Herdwick sheep. Yeah, I'm just doing a little bit of video. So those people have gone somewhere else. Maybe they've just gone down where I am. They couldn't have got up the top that quick. Somebody coming. So I'm going to turn off for a minute. So I don't have to climb up that big hill. I'm going to get, there's a gate there. Across there. And I'm going through that and down. And uh, hopefully I won't have to go through a cow field. Well, it, I don't know. There's a great possibility I will. Um, but it's a nice walk that walk going down that side through some trees and some fields past the farm where the Herdwick sheep are a Cumbrian farmer come to live down this way and he brought some of his sheep with him but they used to mountain mountains and cold weather so uh, they're, they're, they're lost up here all right in the winter so the race is over if I'd come here earlier walking along here, there would have been loads and loads of bikes hurtling past me. I could see them when I was over there. I was um, zooming in with my lens when I was on a walk, skirting round that big hill. I skirted right round it. I've done, I've wanted to follow the contours today and then I went down, down there, to the church really enjoyed it. I've really enjoyed it. I've got the wind behind me. It's probably making a noise on the camera. I don't know. I, I've got no idea. I think I've got it on. Yes, I'm playing. Um, this is recorded. This is the 11th of June 2022. Well, it could be the 10th video, it could be the 20th, I don't know, because I've done lots of short ones as well, which I join up, of course, when I do the WMV later. Um, like I said, I've got loads of wood walks, loads of um, sand bay walks, and I, I sometimes, I, I save them to disc, but I don't always save them to YouTube or anywhere else. I do some, I select some. And some actually go on Ancestry as well, with a web link. Yeah. I've got a lot of, lot of Ancestry work to do. I mean, in many ways, this is what I call living tree. Me as the walker. Me with family. What I'm saying is, quite often, I'm the living tree and want to leave things for my future people. That's if the world doesn't blow up, if we don't destroy ourselves. Meanwhile, now down there is um, St Andrew's Church. There it is. I was down there earlier. I'd be picnic on a bench down there. Looked around the graves, went inside. There was a beautiful bouquet of flowers up at the altar with 70 on it celebration of the Queen's Jubilee and my 70th. I said, oh, thank you. I said. Just going to have another look over this wall a minute. Oh, yeah. I sometimes walk through, I get in the East Fields, I sometimes walk in there just for something different. Quite often when there's a lot of people I do it. You shouldn't get herds of people out here. 
herds. Well, there's a church down there. The church. Crook's Peak getting further away. Further and further away. people coming with white t-shirts I saw a minute ago. So uh, like I said I'm not going up that way. I came around that bend earlier following the red flags. Then went down, down into the village. Then skirted along the base of the wood line and up around the other side of that hill there. It's been a great walk everyone. Great walk. Where those people with white shirts went. They could have been flag pickers. Yeah, remember that trough a couple of hours ago? Took a picture of it, I think, and I went down that track. There's a bike coming. Might be somebody just trying it out. Right over there. He could be just doing his own thing now, having done it earlier. Yeah, you? Yeah. Lovely, isn't it? Yeah, it's nice. The cool wind, isn't it? It's right. cool. Right, there's a biker. He's, he might have done this earlier and he's just coming back to punish himself. There we go. Right, I'm going to turn off Earlier there. I was down walking the edge of that wood. Walking behind that hill there, that one there, walking, coming up round. Earlier than that I went down into the village. Before that I went round that hill and right the way round. On the, the racing track. Last time I was here I walked up that, walked up it. I had a sit on the little stone seat and now I've got a risk going down through these fields I can see someone having a picnic the idea is for me to go down to the bottom there I don't have to go near those people and um, there's a path at the bottom I can walk I just gotta hope there isn't no cows. Do you know what I mean? A cow got charged with murder. It was a big bull. He killed a boy. He killed a, this was in another country, somewhere in Africa. Yeah, and their cows are sacred, but yeah, but he put it on charge with murder. It was really apparently a horrific attack. Unprovoked attack by this bull. Ah, there we go. Okay then, so we're leaving that field. Came down from the top. Came down through this new gate, new post since I was here last. And then we walk back along a nice lovely walk really back towards St James's Church eventually but there's a couple of fields where it could be dodgy in which case I have to try and get in the wood and go around the back <coughs> so I don't have to walk through them see little bit of an incline, you notice it when you're tired <clears throat> every little bit of a hill you notice 
a little bit wheezy. I mean, I'm, I suffer with hay fever and I'm out in this, so I haven't actually used an inhaler. So if I need one, it's mainly at night because at night you're lying flat, even though I try to lie upright. I always end up flat, which I like lying flat. My lungs don't. I try to lie on my side a lot, that helps. <clears throat> See a couple of horses up there. So I came down through there a minute ago. And we should be on the level, just slightly up and down now. <clears throat> I've only just started to get wheezy, by the way. So I guess what I have to do is a bit of self-hypnosis just helps. Wait, well, just stop for a minute. Just to take gentle breaths. Just try and relax the alveoli. It does work, you know, I've been doing it and it's it helps. But you just have to, it was difficult when you're out on the mic. But I've been alright most of the time. <clears throat> I don't know what the video would be like anyone. But we've come down, right down through there. Can't see Crook's Peak now. We won't see Crook's Peak again now. I'm really glad what I've done. There's still little pathways I need to explore. Yeah, they've been putting up some nice gates, nice strong gates. Putting some new plants in for privacy. With these big houses here. These big houses with lovely homes. You know what I mean? Like I say, in my family tree, we have had people who had castles and man mansions. <sighs> it's not, it's after we get across this part of the lane where the risk could happen. <sighs> could be. It's worth spending out on decent gates, so isn't it? If you think about it, at the, in the long run, it's worth it's worth doing that. But I do like this walk. This says just one field till I get to the drove. I don't normally have cows in that field. It's just this one up here, and I've got no idea <coughs> what I'm going to do if they're in there. The only other, other way around it is um, you can go up into the wood and get through higher up, which is what I'll do if I have to. I'm into climbing up again. Do you know what? I've been along here when it's been very hot summer's day, no wind, baking hot. And I'll tell you something, it's lovely the shaded walk, it's beautiful. have my cheese now, I changed my mind here, I thought I'd have it earlier but it does give me indigestion, I had to do a hill so I thought no, wait till we get past this field in case you have to do any running get past this field Tudor and then I hope we can get through it, it's a lot of wires up Used to go straight across, I have to see where the path is still. Oh. Oh. 
can see this lovely oak tree, so might not be oak, but uh, some of them are. Let's turn off a second. 